uh, today we're going to be demonstrating a new stove concept that uh, uh, the idea has been thrown around quite a few times uh, during a brainstorming but uh, nobody has ever tried this out and with the what you saw with Brian's hopper system uh, with all the air leaks and stuff like that uh, it's now time to actually try this idea out and see whether uh, it's worthwhile so the basic concept is refueling canisters. Uh, you have two canisters uh, for fuel. These will act as the inner cylinder. As you can see, uh, been drilled onto the base. There are handles for you to lift up the cylinders when you're done. Okay. Uh, the cylinders will be housed in this uh, outer can here. Uh, if you look, there are rails inside guiding the canisters in. Yep. Uh, and there are secondary and primary air holes here. So when you sit this guy in here, it sits lower than it sits lower than the outside can. Uh, so the secondary air will just rush in from the top. And when I put the concentrator lid on, there should be a nice uh, flame going through. Really not looking for anything except testing whether I can keep this one burning start this guy up and then after that uh, quickly swap them out without much uh, problem with gasification in the flame. Uh, so now uh, I started one fire here and it's in a gas mode, gasifi the gasifying pyrolysis and this is the second fuel canister that's uh, being prepped. Uh, we're going to see whether we can swap it out and see whether the flame still sustains well even once this or that goes up. This was lighted around 5 to 10 minutes ago. Around there, right? I think 5 minutes ago only. Yeah. Okay, so this is gasifying. This is on gas mode, uh, gasifying as well. Uh, we're going to test out a concept of what happens if I swap out the canisters and continue cooking is to simulate a refueling process. So here we go. Hook up this canister. This flame. Put this gas flame in. guy on and voila should take a while for the flame to stabilize see this guy is still going strong in fact and basically we have done a refuel so imagine if this was still was not uh, was going to run out of gas uh, of py uh, pyrolysis material I could have swapped in this one if I had pre-lighted it maybe 5 to 10 minutes ago. So in this way, uh, the refueling uh, problem can be solved by having canisters. Uh, 